Well, salute to Mondo there, chums. Tis I, Counting of the Steves, and I'm back inside the Starfield. Now, I'm in the soul system, and I'm trying to survey it. 100% survey the soul system. Now, I've done Earth. I've done the moon, and I've gone on board that Nova Galactic Star Yard. I say the Earth and the moon. The Earth is like Terra, and the moon is like Luna. Oh, yes, they've got Greek names, it was pointed out to me in my comments. Salute Mondo. Heck yes, of course it is, like lunacy, with werewolves and stuff. Anyways, I'm going to head on over to Jupiter. But what I'm thinking is rather than do an episode per planet, an episode per moon, because this system has got print, no life in it whatsoever, it's all just freaking re resources and you're talking maybe five at best on some of these planets i'm thinking scan the planet and do all the moons associated with that planet in one episode people yes a bumper crop of planets and scanning so here we go we're going to jump on over we're going to do jupiter first because it's a gas giant i'm just going to press one button on this one set course heck yes travel brilliant am i going to get a lovely little cutscene? oh we've arrived at Katie already Okay, golly, oh, well, back into the old menu again. Bit weird how you have to do that step, you know? Chicka pow! And now I can scan it. Okay, left mouse button. There we go. Boom. There's a huge difference between being prepared and carrying too much. Yeah, you're quite right. I haven't sorted out my inventory, have I? But there we go. That's, um, Jupiter fully freaking surveyed, mate. Right, next one. We're going to jump over to Io. It's only got two resources. So here we go. And uh, yeah, let's let's set course. Yes, please. And travel. Am I going to get a cutscene now? Yes, I am. There I go. Meow. Zoom. Cool. I do like the cutscenes in this game. I really do. But you know what? I'm going to get out of my seat and I'm going to sort out my infantry when I land. Oh, hop, we've got we've got to scan it again. There we go. Bang. Chicka pow. Chicka boom. Done, diddly, and done. Now, I want to go to an area where we're going to get both resources. So, just as it changes to helium and iron. There we go. We'll go there. That should do the trick. All right. Hopefully, we'll be able to pick up both resources super quick. Anyway, like I said, I'm just going to sort out my inventory. I'll be right back with thee. Oh, we've got a cut scene. So, I thought I'd better bring you the old cut scene. No curse. Sweet. Is it going to put me outside the ship or in the ship? No, good. That's all right. I can stand up. And I'll sort out my inventory now. Okay, people, we're heading out onto our first moon. Io! I guess. Lovely cup of tea. Right. Now, oh, look, I can see a blue one already. Let's just get under 50 meters. And hopefully, we can get that scanned, people in the view of us. I guess we can. There's a ship landing over there. It looks rather tasty. So we got that done. And... Okay, that's already done. Alright, well, we're just looking for one more blue. And there it is, right there. Chicka power! Scan, dang you. There we go, 100% surveyed. And now I was going to go and take a little cheeky look at that ship. But from here... Hmm, we could go look at it, but... No, I'm just going to press... Oh, look, it took off anyway. Well, that sorts that one out. Okay, well, let's head on back then. And let's go to our next sorte. That's that moon done. Thank you. Yes. Pretty awesome. Okay, so that was the moon of Io. Or Io, I should say. Io. In case that's Io. There's a Ganymede here as well. Is that the right one? Am I thinking of the right one? Europa. There's Ganymede. Let's go do Ganymede. I like Ganymede, I guess. And let's head over to Ganymede. Chicka boom! And X. Love the jumper. And then go back into the menu. Let's go scan Ganymede. Yes. Boom! You scanned, mate. I'll just stick it right there, I think. Chicka boom! We're heading towards Ganymede, people. They are not on Ganymede! No, these creatures are not there! There is no life in this whole system. There's one planet that's got plants. Flora. No fauna. Land then. Let's get a scanning, shall we, people? Exit ship. There it goes. Lovely jubbly. And uh, let's um, bring up the old scanners, shall we? 
Bam 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 Oh, we've got we've got to find a point of interest here. So let's see if we can find one and lock that in. Oh great. There's not one where we've landed. I could head towards that ship and oh no, hold on, I tell a lie. There's one right there. It's a natural formation. We'll head towards that and we'll see if we come across any blues on our way there, people. I normally look for the, you see these plumes of smoke. Sometimes you get the odd rock that lingers around them that's scannable. So I usually make a beeline for those, but not this time. Not seeing any blues right out in the open on this planet. Don't say it's going to be a tricky little get. It probably is. But I'll tell you what, I'll let you know if I come across any blues on this planet, people. Okay, chums, we've come across our first of the resources. Boom! We found water, so we've only got one more resource to find. I haven't found it in the ground, and I haven't found it out in the open. And I still haven't reached that destination. Well, chums, I think I've spotted it. It's this sort of weird-looking pile of rubble right here, next to one of those plumes of smoke. So I was right on my original analysis, I guess. There we go. Well, we've surveyed all the resources. Hopefully, once we get to this structure in 400 meters, We'll have the actual sort of point of interest done. I've arrived! Go, cool, here we are. So, now there's, there's lots of piles of resources here. But they're not really scannable resources. And I don't think this one's going to get added to my lexicon of stuff, to be honest. Okay, vandium and lead. I don't really need it. It's just going to weigh me down, isn't it, really, to be honest. There's nothing to scan here, so I think I need to hit up a different point of interest. It's another natural. We'll head there anyway, and we'll see if there's anything that I can scan, because there's there's nothing here that's scannable to unlock this point of interest. So I'm heading over to this one that almost looks like a cave, but it's not. Jumps. Now there's said to be no life. Yet um I can hear things scuttling around. These things are making freaking weird noises. Okay, I don't know what's going on here, but I don't like it. I don't trust this site one bit. Okay. It's a glowy freaking cave, people. What the actual heck? Okay, well this is a bit freaking different, isn't it? Again though, there's nothing here for me to scan to actually mark this as a proper point of interest. Well, we'll, we'll have this anyway. What the actual flying fudge? Is there any creatures in here? I can hear something moving around. If something jumps out at, the minute, at me in a minute, I'm going to freaking chuck my controller, isn't it? it looks almost like a, a fossilised creature. It's like something out of the movie Aliens. Am I going to get completely ambushed? Nope, I guess not. Okay, there's nothing in here, I guess, then. Hazmat suit? Bloody hell, that's got fairly good ratings, hasn't it? Right, we'll take that anyway. I don't think I'm ever going to, you know, keep it with me, though. Or use it. I mean, a hazmat suit compared to this. This looks freaking awesome. A hazmat suit's going to look fairly clumsy. There we go, people. That was that one, then. So, nothing to scan there. Still haven't managed to tick off this bloody point of interest, then. And I think I've run out of um, interesting sites to go visit. I mean, that's the one I did earlier, isn't it? And oh, no, that's, that's a cave. Well, we don't need to go in a cave. There's going to be nothing to scan in a bloody cave. All right. Well, you know what? I'll fast travel back to my ship and move location. I'll see you at a new location, people. Okay, people, I found one of these diamond-like icons. And yes, these ones normally have the things you scan. There's usually three or two clusters of diamonds that you scan and it pops it. There you go, look. It's popped up now. Oh, I can scan it from this far away. That's pretty good going, isn't it? There we go. The resource is now done, apparently. Normally, you have to scan, like, two of them. That's a bit weird. Oh, well. Done. Go. Cool. And it's that simple, people. There we are. That's all done, then. We can head back to the ship and hit on up another moon. There we go. About 
fast travel. Zoom. We haven't really heard from our crew today. How are you, my friend, my adoring what fan? What can I do for you, Captain? I just wondered how you are, mate. How can I help you? And how can I not help you? Because I want to make sure I never do those things. <laughs> You're okay, buddy. You just smile. Being part of your crew is just the best. I know, right? It's freaking awesome, isn't it? It's lovely. Right, okay, let's head on over here then. Let's see which one's next. So, yes, this is Saturn that we're doing. The rings are Saturn. Oh, no, it's Jupiter. Sorry, Jupiter. Because I highlighted it and I saw that, yeah, you get what I'm saying. Anyway, we're going to Europa now, people. Europa... That's got a couple, hasn't it? So let's head over there then. And yes, I want to set a course. And yes, and we're on our way. And we've arrived, Kated. Uh, a lot of people complain about these load screens, but I didn't edit that. You know, it, it, it's it's fairly quick, to be honest. I mean, yes, it's still a loading screen. Okay, right, here we go. Let's, let's go over here then. And I'll stick it right there. Let's go there then. So this is Frozen Hills we're heading to. I mean, this one's a bit longer, obviously. I, look, I won't cut this, but you'll see how long this loading screen takes. And then normally there's like a cutscene afterwards as well. So, yeah. So is it still loading now? Maybe. But I love these cutscenes because you get to see your ship from all angles. You get to see how the jets are, how the landing gear comes down. And being a sci-fi fan and growing up in the 80s, I just love all of that. I, I just can't help it. I... And it doesn't wear it doesn't film for like much, me. But we should certainly take a look around. I agree, Sarah, because we're scanning every planet. Look, there's one right in the ground as soon as we've landed. Bang. That's done. All right. Well, let's uh, see if we can find any more blues around here, shall we, people? There's no points of interest to be had this time. Aha. We've got a blue there. It looks like water. Oh, we've got a, the ship coming in for a landing. That looks like a pirate vessel, if there ever was a pirate vessel. I mean, normally, if I had a little bit of time to spare, I'd go murdercate them and nick their freaking ship, mate. But you know what? I've already nicked one ship, and you have to register them. It costs quite a lot of freaking monies to register them. There we go. That's 100% surveyed. I'm so tempted to go and look at that ship to see what it is. But, um, yeah, I think I might just leave it a... No, look, we're, we're virtually there. Let's go over there and let's see what type of vessel it is. I can fast travel back again. Well, Jums, there you go. It's in scanning range now. It's actually a UC Vanguard Raptor. So I can't nick it even if I wanted to, really. They're kind of the good guys, aren't they? So we're fast travel back then, people. Oh, thank goodness. Okay, now this looks to be the last of the moons of Jupiter. Yeah, Callisto. Let's go there. The Callisto Project. Brilliant. We're on our way, people. Oh, we're in the system. Oh, my days. What's going on here? I can't even see the blinking moon I'm supposed star to scan. Star parcel freighter to unknown vessel. I have yeah. an urgent pack. No. The star parcel's fleet's got a load of these aging Deimos monsters. Right. Not like tanks, but well past their warranty. It's going to take hours to fix this, if we can get the engine back online at all. Right. I can try and help with the repairs. I'm surprised the ship broke down. Deimos makes good ship. You'd be lucky to make it out of here alive with your engines down. 30 years ago, this ship would be a beast. Uh, maybe more like 50. I got a hot package that's paid for expedited delivery. They'll dock my pay if it doesn't get to its destination. Star Parcel will reward you well if you can assist. Okay, I'll help you. Ah, excellent. Oh, did I just say I'm going to deliver it? All you need it? to do is drop this off to the ship services technician on New Atlantis. All right, I, I can take do it that. From there. It better not Thanks be bloody contraband. For out of this nightmare. Okay. All right, fine. Oh, shite! Didn't mean to do that. Right, well, I'm here to scan a planet. We'll get that done, and then we'll deliver this parcel to um, a New Atlantis. And since you saw me pick that mission up, I'm going to bloody do it for you people. You're going to get to see that in this episode as well. Whether you like it or not! There we go. Let's scan that then. Let's go land over here, I think, people. There's only two resources. It's another one of these iron and um, helium planets, people. You don't get many that are aluminium and iron, do you? Well, I hope we don't come across that place. That place looked like snot. Okay, here we go. Look like the inside of a nostril. Yeah, land here then. Coolio. Now, there's only two resources to be had here. 
I don't know whether there's a point of interest. There's a non-zero chance that this planet once thrived with life. Oh, amazing, a non-zero chance? Are you speaking in frickin' riddles, Sarah? Well, there we go. We've found, we found the, you know, the iron already. There's two more clumps of iron there. Now we've just got to find the last bit, which is the helium-3. A helium-3, it normally looks like the jaggedy ones, and I usually find it near to these plumes of smoke, so I'm just going to walk around and see if I can find anything else here, people. We've got a ship just landed. Oh, look, there it is there. There it is right there. So we might as well get that scanned. I was going to go check out that ship if I didn't find it so bloody quickly. But you know what? Because we've found it and we've completely surveyed it, let's just go and take this package over to New Atlantis. Oh, God's sake. I just want to fast travel back to my ship. Look, there it is right there. One of my days. Well, that's, that's fun, isn't it? Can't get the right angle to fast travel. There we are, fast travel. Yes, please. Lovely. And let's just lock in New Atlantis. We go back out here, back out there. And we're going back to New Jamison, which is inside of the Alpha Centauri system. Alpha Centauri. And we're going to Jamison. Heck, yes, we are. Pal. Talk to Yumi at the lodge. Return Commander Tullet. No, we don't want to do any of that. We want to deliver the star parcel. There we go. Let's do that one. I don't know whether I got the mission selected. That's probably why it was being a bit finicky there, people. Am I going to get a lovely animation or am I just going to appear on the landing pad? Probably just appear on the landing pad. This is my thoughts on this one because I've been here a few times. Anyway, this lighting screen is taking a bit longer than normal, isn't it? Right, eh? Well, we've arrived, Kated. Um, let's see what's going on with that parcel, then. Da -da 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 -da. Oh, look! I've got the Mantis mission! The Mantis mission has appeared in my inventory, people. I'm going to have to do a live stream on that one. I guess I am. Supply. No. Survey, 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 survey. Back to the grind. Light in the darkness. The old neighbourhood. Activities. Under activities. Deliver the parcel. That's the one I want to do. Deliver the parcel package to New Atlantis. Well, I've arrived in New Atlantis. I would have expected... Oh, okay, we'll just go over to this guy. Here we are. Hello, buddy. I got a parcel got for thee. Yes. Need some parcel. Time? There you go. You the courier? I've been expecting you. I'm not Star the courier. Parcel has your payment right here. Anything else you need? How much money did I just... I just got 7,500 credits, people. Freaking awesome. No, that's everything. Hey. Thank you very much. Yeah. What? Do you want something, what Sarah? What can I help you with? Um, you said hey Hi. to me. You said hey to me. I... Mm, okay, there we are. So we're going to go back to the old Sol system. And we'll be scanning all the planets around, another, well, moons around another planet in the next episode, people. But for now, I'm just going to hit on up a quick save there. There's a quick save done. So if I was to go back to the solar system, let's just uh, jump back over to the old solar system, shall we? Lovely. Zoom on out. Solar system. Chicka power. So we've done all of Jupiter and Jupiter's moons. I don't know what that thing is there. So, there is this that's sitting on its own. We could do Venus on its own in the next episode, people. Yeah, we'll probably do Venus. All right, well, there we go, people. That's everything for you in this episode. Salute to Mondo, and um, see you again soon. In fact, I need to zoom in and get myself a bit of a better photo of, of this somehow. All right, there we are. I'll work that out in my own time. Cheery bye, people. Have a good one. Goodbye, goodbye, and goodbye again.